welcome to Inside Myanmar channel. I am Suki. Today I'm going to introduce you to the oldest Armenian church in Yangon. Now I have arrived at the front of the church. Its name is the Armenian Apostolic Church of St. John the Baptist. It is located at the corner of Machan Road and Guangzhou Road. Let's go in first. The Armenian community first came to Burma from Persia in the 17th century. This was much earlier than British colonization. This church was built in 1862 and consecrated as the Church of St. John the Baptist in 1863. It is the oldest church in Yangon, being 161 years old. How surprising, isn't it? There are a few churches that were built before this church, but this is the only one that has survived until now. Yangon Heritage Trust, YHG, unveiled a blue tag at the entrance, noting the church's historical significance. Look at the door. This door is the original one from 1862. It may look kind of new because it has been repaired, cleaned and maintained until today. Look at the door lock. I haven't seen this kind of lock before. They are pretty old. Oh, look at the architectures. This is the architecture of the 18th century. This church is precious. This place is decorated with Armenian orientations. Oh guys, here is something significant. Did you know that Jesus was crucified on the cross, right? They say there is a piece of wood from the cross. That's why this place is regarded such a holy place. Armenian merchants, known as Kodiars, had an extensive overland and later they started to an ocean trading network that was reaching most of the world. During the colonial period in Yangon, the Armenians maintained their reputation as successful traders and contributed to the prosperity of the cosmopolitan city. As successful traders, the Armenians built most of colonial buildings some of which are still stand today, such as Central Post Building, Myanmar Economy Bank 3, and Tran Hotel. Also, there is an upstairs. Let's go and take a look. The roads were destroyed during World War II. As you can see, they have been repaired, but the supports for the roofs are still original. They are from the 18th century architecture. There is a bell for religious activities. It has been here since the church was built. You can pull this ring to ring the bell. Okay, let's go outside. So, this is the memorial letter of Aaron Benny, who died in World War II. He is also one of the family members of this Armenian church. This is the oldest Armenian letter. Since it is the oldest one, even some of the Armenian priests can read this one. This church suffered bombing during the war, so most of it has been renovated. But the supports and the bricks are the original ones. They are from the 18th century architecture. This is such a holy place. So, 
that's all for today. Today, I showed you the 161 years old Armenian church in Yango. I hope you guys like this video. There will be more interesting videos, so don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you in the next video. Bye.